Cao Cao takes the rank of Duke of Wei and succeeds in stabilizing his forces. He defeats Ma Chao of Guanzhong and strengthens his control of the north. While healing the damage taken at Chibi, he prepares for another campaign south. Elsewhere, Sun Quan forges an alliance with Liu Bei and waits for his chance to take the land. But their relations soon sour because of Liu Bei's possession of Jing, which Wu believes should have been theirs. Using Jing as a stepping stone, Liu Bei invades Liu Zhang's Bashu. With that success, he has finally obtained the country he has long searched for. In the north, Cao Cao. In the east, Sun Quan. In the south, Liu Bei. The world of the three kingdoms of Wei, Wu, and Shu have been established. It is rather hard for us to be optimistic given our current circumstances. Where do we strike first? We're surrounded by Liu Bei in the Yi province to the west, and Sun Quan in Jian in the east. And now we have Guan Yu to the south of us in Jin province. Perhaps. Although, if we don't make a move, the chaos will never end. If we will be attacked once we launch an attack of our own, we should refrain from doing so for now. How about we focus on Han Zhong to the north of Yi instead? Zhang Lu is in charge of Han Zhong. Compared to Liu Bei, I suppose he's not much of an opponent. What made you think of him, Cousin Dun? Han Zhong. Yes. Han Zhong. I like it, Master Shaho Dun. If we can control Hong Zhong, we can use it to hold off Liu Bei's attacks from Yi province. Very well. We shall build up our army in order to invade Han Zhong. Wait a moment, my lord. Doesn't that mean we'll be turning our backs to the east? What's to stop somebody from attacking Hefei while we take Han Zhong? I was thinking the same thing. Eugene, Li Dian. You two work well together. I am certain that you can handle the Wu army's assault. Will you agree to defend Perfei from the enemy for me? I had a feeling you might ask that. Leave the defense of Perfei to us. I shall do my absolute best not to impede Master Li Dian's efforts. Very well. Our entire strategy depends on you. Zhang Liao, I want you to lead our defense at Perfei. Work together with Li Dian and Eugene to hold off the Wu forces. Yes, my lord. I will defend Perfei with my very life if need be. I suppose I must respect our lord's decision. But, I must say, I didn't see this coming. The three of you are to leave for Perfei immediately. Everybody else, head to Tianshui. We must defeat Zheng Lu and seize control of Han Zheng as quickly as possible. Ha. Ha. We finally made it to Hangzhong. Hey, what's the matter, son? You're not tired already, are you? We haven't even got to the fun part yet. It seems Wu's massive army is on its way to invade Perfei. I don't imagine Zhang Liao will go down without a fight. 
but he is heavily outnumbered. We should send him some reinforcements. Yes, but where should we send them from? We can't use any troops near Xu Chung. Manchong. What about Jing province? I have a suspicion that Guan Yu will work together with Wu, but... No, there has been no unusual activity in Jin province. Liu Bei must be focused on governing Bashu. Furthermore, it appears that Liu Bei has rejected Sun Quan's request to return to Jin province. Of course, I doubt he ever planned on giving it back. They pretended to work with Wu all that time, but were just using them. Liu Bei's strategist Zhuge Lian is quite the hypocrite. If Jing is currently the subject of a stalemate, we can afford to send some troops to deal with Wu. Send a messenger to Xu Chung and order reinforcements to Perfei. We shall continue with our plan to slay Zhang Lu. The situation in Perfei only underscores the need for us to finish up here in Hanjiang immediately. Hanjiang is a shortcut from Bashu to Shan'an. We must control it if we are to stabilize the battle lines on our eastern and western borders. Yes, I agree. So, let's defeat Zhang Lu as quickly as possible and make it happen. Okay, let's quickly take Han Chong. I'm counting on you to watch my back out there, son. You make sure to keep an eye on me, father. It may just be your very own son who defeats Zhang Lu. Young Song is widely known for his treacherous nature. With the right circumstances, we might be able to get him to defect to our side. of this territory. this territory. Pay my debt to Master Zhang Wu. I shall defeat you in battle in his name. If I fall in battle, what will become of my troops? I cannot give up just yet. Ah! 
However, at times I find myself envious of your strength. We simply need to hang in there. It is always easier to fight your way out of trouble. Fight your way out of trouble. It looks like this is the end for me. That certainly went easily. Let us enjoy this moment in the sun. Very well done. It's kind of cute seeing you in action. In battle, you show no hesitation whatsoever. At times, I find myself envious of your strength. We've lost our key outpost? As I feared, there may be no way to overcome the Way Army. Is there no way we can make clandestine contact with any Way Army? We've managed to turn one or two.
taking control of this territory. Now, take defensive positions. Young Pin Gate is vital to hands off. I'll never let you take it. Young Ping Gate, we have the advantage now. Uh, let us enjoy this moment in the sun. You've proven to be a very talented fighter. Young Ping Gate has fallen? You must be joking. Again! We shall use this path to advance on Hanjong! Don't stop until we reach the enemy's position! You will never take Mount Tiandong! I will defend it with my life! I have failed in my duty, Master Jiang Lu. You have my deepest apologies. Catch it, Mount Chop Chop. This is big for our forces. Let us enjoy this moment in the sun. Hey, you're really doing well out there. I expect nothing less from you. Young Dong has fallen? Then we can't win now. We're finally here. We must fight to protect Henjong. All right. I need everyone to defend this area.
everyone to defend this area. After reviewing my strategy, that certainly went easily. I knew you were good, but not this good. from you I will resist no more I ask that you let the people of this land live we did it father Hong Jong belongs to us now nice work out there son that was impressive showing for your first battle all right I need everyone to defend this area Master Cao Cao, I must express my profound gratitude for your magnanimous treatment of me. However, there is something I wish to ask of you. Why would you spare me despite the fact that I have turned my blade against you twice now? I must find a way to eliminate war from this land. However, the same cannot be said for people. 
It would be a waste to lose an officer as talented as you. I appreciate your unequivocal answer. I'm also greatly humbled to hear that you think so highly of me. Hong De, the land is about to experience turmoil the likes of which it has never seen. I desire to be the one that finally puts an end to this chaos. As such, I would like to ask you to join me on my quest. It shall be an honor, my lord. I have discovered newfound purpose to my life. I hereby vow to serve as one of your most dedicated subjects. Well noted. I look forward to accomplishing great things with you. Father, Hanjong is ours. What is our next move? Our men still have some fight left in them, so we could continue on. Perhaps, but we lack the provisions to feed them. As it stands, we are forced to rely on the supplies sent from Shang'an. Excuse me, my lord, may I make a suggestion? Hmm? I am Tima E. Liu Bei has not held the lands of Bashu for long. I do not believe he has a firm grip on the territory yet. We should be emboldened by our recent successes and attack Bashu in Yi province. I can see some merit to your suggestion. This could be our chance to finally put an end to Liu Bei's meddling. However, Guan Yu is in Jing province, while Sun Quan controls Perfei. If we make a move now, we will have to worry about an attack on our rear border. Of course, I am sure we are not the only ones thinking this way. I have a feeling Liu Bei and Sun Quan are of the same mind. That is the nature of our three kingdoms. In that case, we should move as quickly as possible. We need to disrupt the equilibrium of the Three Kingdoms. Uh, please, forgive me for being so blunt. Think nothing of it. Going forward, I want to hear your opinion on all matters of strategic importance. We shall leave just enough troops in Hanjong as necessary and the rest shall march east on Perfei. Cao Pi, spread the word amongst the men. Xiao Dun, Xiao Yuan, I have a request to make of the both of you. What is it, my lord? And why are you acting so formal? If we put pressure on Wu now, we may be able to get out from the fact that Liu Bei and Sun Quan are aligned against us. However, I will require your assistance in order to make it happen. So basically, you want us to help support your reckless plan. How's that any different than every other time we've been there for you? What do you need us to do? My plan is to lure Liu Bei to Hanjong. And during that time, we will slay Guan Yu. What? Hanjong is essential to the land of Bashu. If we purposely leave it sparsely defended, they will be eager to try and take it from us. Meanwhile, we will form a pact with Sun Quan to invade Qing province, which they have long coveted. If we tell them that Guan Yu will also fall, they will not refuse. Yes, the alliance between them is rather fragile. I am sure we can bring Sun Quan to our side. However, if Liu Bei catches wind of this, we could end up losing both Han Zhong and Jing. That's why we need to stoutly defend Han Zhong, and then let them think that they're about to win without us actually losing. Of course, that'll be a fine line to walk. In order to send troops to Jing, we need to leave our best troops in Hanjiang, but reduce its overall numbers. Of course, they still might suspect our plan. That is why I need one of my best men to be leading the defense. 
I believe that should be enough to throw them off our scent. So that is where we come in. I understand. I'll serve as the decoy in Han Zhang. Forget it, Cousin Du. I'll take care of it. Besides, I'm sure you're just dying to be a part of this battle to slay Guan Yu and Jing. Right, my lord? Okay, then. It's time for me to go and do my thing. Thank you. I am certain that Liu Bei will throw everything he's got at you. This is a most dangerous mission, Shahu Yuan, but I am counting on you. Don't worry. I think yours is the toughest job of them all. You've got all that traveling to do, and you're not getting any younger either. Be careful out there, okay? Hmm. I shall take that into consideration. We shall slay Guan Yu and finally put an end to this balance between our three kingdoms. This is our chance. We cannot afford to fail. You can count on us. Now, I must decide on a location to speak privately with Sun Quan. We are looking to move past the history of our relationship. Therefore, I think Rushiku should do nicely. It looks like Liu Bei has begun his attack on Han Zhong. We must defend this land no matter what. Be sure to give it your all. But don't push yourself too hard. Got that, everybody? Ah, your words of encouragement bring hope to us all. It shall be my honor to defend Han Zhong beneath your command, glorious General Sha Ho Yuan. Father. There's no need to overexert yourself like that. Listen carefully, son. When you're a great warrior like me, you'll come to see that being like this is simply your natural state of being. In fact, it's kind of like a rite of passage into manhood. You just worry about being yourself out there and you'll be fine. Yes, father. What's gotten into him all of a sudden? We must drive off Liu Bei and defend Han Zhong with everything we've got! The morale of the Shu forces appears high. We must exercise due caution here. General Sha Ho Yuan! Our target has been determined. Capturing that area will deflate their morale. We need Han John if Nestor Lu Bei's dream is to ever take flight. It's time to convince the enemy to hand it over. This land is a key location for Wei as well. I will defend it with my very life. <laughs> Defensive Abatis has sustained damage. Don't you let such a thing happen. Fine. I'll take care of it myself. 
Our target has been determined. Capturing that area will deflate their morale. What? What is the commander doing here? No matter. This is my chance for glory! Hey! I'm trying to fix the barrier here! Somebody come deal with these enemies for me! I will remember your face. This death will be repaid twofold next time you meet. Our target has been determined. Capturing that area will deflate their morale. myself to be defeated before claiming Hangzhou. I bring disgrace to my name. <laughs> okay, I fixed the barrier. This ought to let us rest a little easier. For now. <laughs> they are defending their camp with an abatee. This will slow us down. Giving up. We won! Good work, everybody. That certainly went easily. Let us enjoy this moment in the sun. You are shining brightly as a result of your efforts out there. Hey! You're really doing well out there! I expect nothing less from you. I'm getting through. has been determined. Yeah. Capturing that area will deflate their morale. You face Zheng Bao, son of Zheng Fei. I hate to break it to you, but Mount Tiangong is mine. No, 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 I don't think so. I'm defending this place. Defensive positions! Ready to face me? I shall personally see to its defense. That certainly went easily. 
In battle, you show no hesitation whatsoever. At times, I find myself envious of your strength. Damn it. Looks like I have to retreat. Father's not gonna be happy about this. Out! Take defensive positions! That certainly went easily. You are shining brightly as a result of your efforts out there. I can't go any further. I have failed in the task I was given. We've kept Mount Changdang safe. I'm just glad I didn't let Father down. Let us enjoy this moment in the sun. Amazing! You sure know how to fight! Amazing! You sure know how to fight! some help here. Capturing that base will weaken the enemy greatly. All units, march! I'm getting to you. Come! Know the terror of facing Ma Chao in battle. Certainly went easily. In battle, you show no hesitation whatsoever. At times, I find myself envious of your strength. Shining 
quickly as the result of your efforts out there. Our target has been determined. Capturing that area will deflate their morale. After reviewing my strategy, that certainly went easily. In battle, you show no hesitation whatsoever. At times, I find myself envious of your strength. Good. This battlefield is too tough for my liking. See you later. I completed my objective, but the thing that I wanted most managed to slip through my grasp. All right. I need everyone to defend this area. Let us enjoy. This moment in the sun. You are shining brightly as a result of your efforts out there.
show no hesitation whatsoever. At times, I find myself envious of your strength. Sure know how to fight. That soap move went easily. Hey, you're really doing well out there. I expect nothing less from you. Our target has been determined. Capturing that area will deplete their morale. We shall defend this position. Do not allow a single enemy through. Certainly went easily. Your skills are simply magnificent! I have failed to take Han Jung. For now, all I can do is retreat. At last, they're giving up their invasion. Finally, breathe a sigh of relief. Report! Our main camp at Mount Dingjun has been attacked, led by Huan Zhong. What? This old man's a real thorn in our side. I'll take care of this. Son, look after things while I'm gone. Hey, Father, wait.
I have most distressing news. General Shaho Yuan has been slain by the enemy officer Huang Zhang. Huh? What? Father. It can't be true. No! It's impossible. Just impossible. How could this happen? I imagine the men must be equally distraught at losing the general. This is no time for us to be continuing the fight. We must pull back and reform our defensive lines. Master Guo Huai, please make the necessary arrangements. Of course! We must do all we can to keep the men safe. Are you ready to go, Master Shaho Ba? Yes. I can't believe General Shaho Huan is dead. Yeah, it doesn't feel real. Well, things have taken a turn for the worse. Liu Bei has brought his entire army to invade Han Zhong. He must feel that he has a chance at seizing it after defeating Yuin. Hmm. You're much calmer than I expected, given the circumstances. Shaho Yuan gave his life to put us in this situation. We cannot afford to fail him. We will make our stand in Hanjiang and meet the impending attack by Liu Bei's army. Sima Yi, I want you to inform me immediately if you notice any movements in Jing province. Of course, my lord. Liu Bei appears to have taken up position on Mount... Jun, we must thoroughly defeat him and seize control of Han Zhong. It's not completely the same, but it reminds me of one castle. As a strategist, I wish to head to the... Please, will you... I have only come this far thanks to the... ...and sacrifices of so many around me. I must make my grand dream a reality. Something is odd about the way Cao Cao is conducting this battle. Almost as if he has an ulterior motive. There is little point to your suspicions, Master Zhuge Liang. You will fall here in battle by my hand. All right. I need everyone to defend this area.
certainly went easily. Well done. You have the heart of a warrior. I'm deadly serious. Wow, you're better than I thought. We shall defend this position. Do not allow a single enemy through. Easily. That was quite a spectacle. Truly amazing. It would be prudent to retreat for now. I must determine Cao Cao's true objective as soon as I can. Master Xu Long has escaped from danger? Impressive. I will remain here then. Let us enjoy this moment in the sun. you to control Han Chong. For the people and for all my friends, I must defeat you! Now, we take defensive positions! There's an ill wind blowing across the stage. Your skills are simply magnificent! We cannot afford to lose this position! I shall personally see to its defense! has been surrounded by Guan Yu's forces. Everything is going exactly as I planned. As such, we no longer have any need for Han Zhang.
<laughs> I see what you're up to. Most in. Oh. <laughs> the strategies are proving most. The battle for Hanjiang is just beginning. Zhao Ren, I want you to take Manchang and Pangde to assist the efforts at Fan Castle. Yes, my lord. We shall put a stop to Guan Yu's momentum. Guan Yu is known as the God of War. We will have to give our very best to defeat him. I must give my all, much like Master Shaho Yuan did. Shahodun, we must also head for Fan Castle as soon as our preparations are ready. No, Cao Cao, you need to rest. You were forced to quickly traverse a great distance between Han Zhang and Perfei, fighting all the while. Even you must be exhausted after all that. Shahodun. Yuin said so himself. You mustn't push yourself too hard. We shall put an end to this battle in Jing province. Let us go forth and reward Cao Cao with reports of victory and serenade him with songs of success. Very well. I shall leave it up to you then. This time, we will slay the god of war and tilt the balance of power in our favor amidst this chaotic land. This should allow us to execute a wider range of strategies. Liu Bei successfully repelled.